As someone who's been gaming since the 80s, I've seen the industry's ups and downs, twists and turns. Somehow it never quite winds up where you expect. I started my own gaming career more than two decades ago as a tester on a little game called Madden NFL. In the years since, I've worked at companies from Xbox and Take-Two to Capcom and Midway Home Entertainment, launching console classics both old and new, producing projects with simply massive budgets and sometimes the ambition to match, or those with barely two rupees to rub together. But whether it was Devil May Cry's, Mortal Kombat's, or Outer Worlds, I've always gravitated towards smaller, more independent teams and the experiences only those teams can deliver. What first drew me into the emerging tech space of VR is what still keeps me here. I want my holodeck. And we don't get there without innovating on the hardware and the software. I can tell you as a former EP, now head of games portfolio at Oculus Publishing, what animates me is finding new ways to empower my teams and our partners to invent the next generation of games, apps, and experiences with us. Because again, I want that holodeck. My name is Sinead Terry Bryant, and thank you for joining us for MetaConnect 2025. There's been an explosion of creativity since we last connected, and the next great thing is going to come from people like you, all around the world. Are you ready? Let's walk through the different types of experiences available through our platform. First, let's look at apps and worlds on Meta Horizon. Then we'll talk AI glasses and AI-powered apps. So what is Meta Horizon? Meta Horizon is a social platform that's optimized for the metaverse, including apps, tools, and services, everything you need to help people connect. This includes Meta Horizon OS, which powers our MetaQuest VR headsets, and the Meta Horizon mobile app. For me, Meta Horizon is about presence, social, and meaning. Let me walk you through what I mean. First up, presence. It starts here. Presence is how we describe the sense of being transported in VR. Whether it's to Machu Picchu or a vampiric Venice, users will feel as though they've stepped out of the rooms and into their wildest imaginations. These digital experiences on Meta Horizon are an extension of their world, and users can be a part of those experiences rather than just looking at them on a screen. From VR to mobile, presence connects users through embodiment and interactions with the spaces, places, people, and things around them. Next up, social. Our virtual presence unlocks a new level of social connection. Experiences on Horizon can bridge physical and emotional gaps, bringing people together to do somewhat impossible things, like play golf on Mars, or be almost impossible places, like attending a concert without leaving your living room. The nearly impossible awaits. And lastly, meaning. Together with presence and social, experiences are experienced. Why just watch a moment when you can be a part of it? Meta Horizon empowers you to take your creative vision to the next level with tools, tech, and support so that you can deliver on more profound and meaning-filled moments. So what do apps look like on Meta Horizon? Well, for now, there are three main categories to consider. There are immersive apps, mixed reality apps, and panel apps. Meta Horizon apps can support a wide variety of use cases and genres, such as gaming, entertainment, fitness, or productivity. They can be used by solo users or social users for fun or for GSD, getting stuff done. Immersive apps use the power of presence to transport users into new VR environments, as real or as virtual as you desire. Users can step directly into your worlds, your stories, no matter where they are. There's power in presence, so think about how you want to use it. And while we're talking immersive, one of my favorite recent releases is Ghost Town by the folks at Fireproof Games. Imagine. You're a ghost hunter named Edith, exercising your way through the city's restless spirits. But your brother suddenly goes missing, and the stapes become deeply personal, and the puzzles are ones that only you can unravel. Smartly designed and painstakingly crafted, this narrative-heavy game will immerse you in a web of supernatural mystery and intrigue, and, well, I won't spoil the ending. Oh, and for scaredy cats, like me, this one has zero jump scares, so you can get your horror fix without jumping out of your skin and or headset. Ghost Town is available in the MetaQuest store now, so go and grab it. Mixed reality apps give you the ability to redefine reality. You can take the user's own room and reinvent it around them. It's more than merely augmenting. You can place a virtual plant on a real-world table. You can watch enemies spawn from a hole they just blew in your living room wall. Or you can peer into outer space through the portal of a starship that was your bedroom window just moments ago. The power of mixed reality is the power to make the familiar fantastical. And that's just what I did, transforming my guest room into a test room of secret agenting skills. 
After 30 minutes of ducking, dodging, and dancing my way through wall-to-wall -wall lasers, I definitely think I was worthy of double O status. That's laser dance. Transform your room into a dastardly den of dangerous death rays. Laser dance is releasing soon, so keep your eyes and ears open and maybe do some stretches first, okay? Panel apps keep your users connected with their favorite experiences as they browse, watch, and multitask in mixed reality. Be part of their perfect workspace, their personal theater, or their augmented home. Developers can bring their existing Android apps to Meta Horizon and consider adding unique features to give your audience a one-of-a-kind spatial experience. And speaking of multitasking, have you ever been immersed in your favorite VR game and heard the all-too-familiar ping of a new text or notification? Check out Spatial Phone Mirror and Control. Even if you're fully immersed in a game like Ghost Town, you can check recent text and notifications all in a mirror of your phone screen, in headset. So those are the rules when it comes to immersive, mixed reality, and panel apps. But rules are meant to be broken. So any and all of these categories can be mixed, remixed, or outright rewritten. The only limits are your imagination. Because, again, holodex. Oh, and before I forget, Meta Horizon apps support the most common business models, from free-to-play or paid to in-app purchases or subscriptions. Build an app for yourself and your local community, or build a global business, or build a holodeck. You get me. In addition to apps, consider worlds. These immersive experiences can be instantly distributed across mobile and VR. With Meta's $50 million creator fund, you can pocket monthly bonuses, sell digital goods, win cash prizes, and boost income with extra mobile incentives. So one of my favorite worlds is Bobber Bay Fishing. I may not look like it, but I'm a sucker for a good fishing game. And again, it's playable in both mobile and VR, which means I can play at home or I can play on the go. And funny enough, whenever I go fishing, I always seem to catch a poisonous puffer fish, just like real life. Now, let's switch gears to AI. Not only are we seeing AI push the boundaries of what's possible in Meta Horizon, but you can also check out new AI native experiences enabled by glasses. With the Meta Wearables Device Access Toolkit, you can now access the sensors on our AI glasses to build integrations with your mobile apps. Stay tuned to Meta Connect to learn more about how to get started with the toolkit in upcoming sessions. Finally, I want to speak to what makes Meta unique and why you can confidently choose us as your development platform or development partner. First, innovation. We are pushing the boundaries of experience. We want to give you cutting edge tools that you need to transform how people connect and feel present. Second, commitment. We have years of leadership, investment, and deep devotion to the success of these industries and the developer and creator economies. Third, reach. We're bringing opportunity and access to as many people in the world as possible. With Meta, you can reach a large and ever-growing audience to have the biggest impact. And finally, choice. We want to meet you where you are. You should be able to use your favorite and familiar tools to build, test, iterate, and publish experiences with Meta. But don't just take my word for it. One of our closest partners, Vertigo Games, had this to say. With Meta, we're able to create best-in-class VR experiences. Their developer and consumer focus and their commitment to inventive tools and tech have been invaluable in helping Vertigo Games deliver the highest quality content to players. From Meta Horizon with apps and worlds to AI with glasses and more, there are as many ways to create with Meta as there are ideas to create. So let this be your call to action and your call to greatness. Are you ready to start brainstorming and exploring, experimenting and inventing? Make something cool. And I can't wait to see you again when next we connect. Thank you and have a great show. Mm -hmm.